Hi, my name's Andy. I'm from Team Robo Aaron, and we're the only Irish team competing in the SPL. We're from Maynooth University in Kildare. One of the rule changes this year is the addition of a, of a visual referee to start the ready state. So for that, we created a visual referee detector that is able to detect when the referee is putting his, their arms in the air. And how we did that is we, we trained a model that was able to predict this. And we also used some semi-synthetic data, which basically means that we used computer generated data to create our data set. So we were able to make thousands of images of hundreds of different types of people and different backgrounds and stuff so that we could train this model with better data a lot quicker than getting, say, a hundred people in a room yeah. together and getting them to do poses. The, <laughs> the HDWK team is starting with one robot less because they already picked one up and the game begins. All right, quite an interesting tactic uh, for the beginning of the game. If they can get Zolvitel, they got good ball control, but now um, Robo Aaron are already there, so they're dueling a bit to see who can get the ball. All right. Robo Aaron on the attack. One on one right now. Um, however, the HDWK team seems to have gotten the ball back, and now ah, there's a bit of a fight. <laughs> it's quite unclear what's happening, but if the blue six is quick enough, he's got the ball, and then he can clear it away from the uh, their own half to start the first attack. All right, the first go uh, shot by uh, Robo Aaron was blocked, so no danger there. And lots of robots in the way. Oh, the ball got stuck there, so now we had to free it. And <laughs> it seems to be a close fight so far, with um, neither team making that much progress, though we are in the half of the HWK, so Robo Aaron is definitely <laughs> feeling safe. Lots of shouts from the sidelines, encouraging the, the robots, and now the robot seems to have some difficulties getting up because the ball was in the way, but that worked out fine. Very well. Okay, so now the ball seems to be making some progress. But HWK defended successfully. Oh, lots of falling. Um, but hopefully they can get to the ball and start their first attack. Oh. So now it's looking a bit more difficult. HWK only has four robots on the field left, and then, of course, the goalkeeper. Um, so they have to hope that their offense is um, either very good or uh, it might get a bit difficult because, um, of course, due to the indirect kick rule, um, you do need two robots to have at least touched the ball, which at this point is, of course, the case. But for the future, we do hope that they can get the. Uh, get the robots back in place. Oh, Robert Aaron seems to be uh, fighting past the uh, defending robots and seems to have a clear shot on the goal. Let's hope that the goalie reacts. Oh, okay, but the sh shot was a bit short, so chances are left. Oh, very proactive defending of the HWK team. Very innovative. I like it. <laughs> um, the rest of the Robo Aaron robots do not quite seem to be following up, so HTWK actually seems to successfully defend for now. And they just need to agree on who is supposed to play the ball, because right now they're in a three-way tie and the ball is stuck again. Oh. Right, but HTWK seems to have defended successfully for now and also getting one of their robots back. So now they're at least only one down, I think. One, two, three, four versus... Yes. They're one robot short, but that's okay for now. And yes, HTWK's first advance to the enemy half, but ah, lots of stumbling. A bit difficult in the execution phase for now, but it's, it's looking quite interesting, a very even game. Um, I can't quite see how much time there's left, but surely a few minutes have passed already. All right, six minutes are left. Um, 
So the first half is almost half over, but um, so far very even. Robert Aaron had one decent chance, but it was very well defended. And now they're, um, either team is trying to prove an advantage over the other, but it's not that clear right now. Oh. Okay, strong, strong kick by Robo Aaron, and if they get to the ball first, they might have a decent shot at the goal, but... Oh, they got through! So now they're very close to the goal. And they'd make a shot, and it's in! Very strong shot, goal for Robo Aaron. All right, and the game begins again. Sadly, HWK had one robot not quite make it into a correct position, so he got penalized. But HWK takes clear control of the ball with a very nice uh, start. And um, now they have to try to make up the one goal difference and their players coming back. So I believe they have a very decent chance. Ooh. All right, so the walking on the grass seems to be a bit of a difficulty for the for the blue team, but they're making their advancements right now, and they have indeed already touched the ball twice, so whatever they do now... They are trying to make their way through, uh, but HTWK lost the ball, they can't see it right now. So now it's going to go into another duel, which... Oh! Looks like HTWK might actually get... Ah! It's difficult. They only have two robots in front. The third one... Oh! <laughs> Just seemed to find something on the, on the field and dove after it. But sadly, that was not the ball. But hopefully, if... Oh, yes, he turns around, so he might... All right, that's a two on one, three on one for HWK versus Robo Iron. So if they get the ball, they might try to progress further. Uh, sadly, the Robo Iron team seems to be running and walking a bit faster, but... HWK definitely has lots of robots in place to stop the ball for now. Let's see if they can uh, get it out of the danger zone. But Robo Aaron obviously has something to say about that. And right now it's back to a 1v1. And possibly Robo Aaron... Oh, getting in the way a bit there. That's, that's the violent way to win the ball, let's say. But um, they shoot and... Okay. Goal kick for blue because the ball was shot into the outside by a, a Robo Aaron player, but um, the goalie seems to manage that quite well. Gonna shoot the ball away, I presume. Yes, there he goes. That was a very good shot. All right. If HWK can capitalize on that, they are very far forward again. They just need follow up player or two, but it's looking good. Sadly, it seems as if Robo Aaron have a bit of a more stable walk. Oh, very strong ball. HTWK is progressing very far into the enemy half for the first time, which is very good. And if the four might follow up, they... Ooh, bit of a fight again. <laughs> but Robo Aaron in a very defensive setup right now. All seven robots in their own half. And that kind of clumping is very difficult to get through, so... Um, right, in the last few seconds of the game. And the first half concludes.
So you scored a uh, goal in the first half against the HWK Robots. Yeah. Um, how about the second half? Well, the second half, another one, or maybe two. But uh, I liked the, the goal from the first half. It was a, a tough fight. It went all over the place. Both teams did, did a good job. And uh, then we got a goal out of it. I think it was a, a, a very exciting, uh, very, um, you know, engaging uh, scene. So and then you know, a goal at the end. And it was, it was good. Yeah. So I enjoyed it very much. So. Thank you very much and good All luck right. for the second half. Thank you and very much. the ball Thank is free. Robo Aaron had a good kick and now the seven seems to be moonwalking again. Um, they did that the last half too, I noticed. So that's quite interesting. I'm not quite sure why they do that. But now I have some difficulty seeing the ball. Um, but it does seem to be moving towards Robo Aaron. There's a bit of a fight going on there. And HWK seems to ah actually be making some progress right now um but of course there's like three robo Aaron players there if they can coordinate each other they might successfully defend but it's ah sadly the attacking robot from hwk seems to have fallen so It's looking like they defended that for now. So the ball is around the middle of the field again, so it's anyone's game right now. Um, HWK, of course, hoping to get that follow-up goal, to uh, get it to a draw, and then hopefully, of course, uh, win the match. While Robo Aaron is, uh, would be quite happy with the current score, but, of course, they would also like to extend their lead. So um, both teams still have a lot to fight for, because one goal from HWK and the game is... Uh, even again. Okay. Robot Aaron back on the attack with two robots. So if they coordinate well, they might make it around the uh, the defense. But it's, um, it's looking quite even at the moment. Dueling again. And it seems as if HWK defend that attack successfully, but... Robo Aaron has backup coming their way, so they shoot and they hit their own robot. That did not go very far. Um, oh, the blue robot seemed to have almost made it back up, but has been declared fallen, so it's now placed away. But the ball successfully went back into the half of Robo Aaron, so um, it is now their turn to defend. And two HWK robots attacking right now. Getting pretty close to the goal with only two defenders in the way. And if they get a shot off right now or very soon, they. Ooh! If they get a shot off now, they might have a very good chance at a goal. Keeping on dribbling. It's getting very close, but Robo Aaron does have a lot of robots there, so. Ah! Oh, right into the ends of the next HWK robot. And the last defender has fallen. Oh, and he plays right into his legs. He might have a shot yet. Oh, the goalie got there last second to block the ball. But. Oh, they might not. Robo Aaron might not get their self coordinated in time. And then HWK actually has a chance to get the ball into the goal. Oh. Oh, that was so close. A very, very, very good attempt. But for now, oh, oh, right in this and goal! <laughs> All right, HWK managed to um, get back to an even score. But sadly, two of the robots didn't make it back in time for set, so they were taken off out of the field. So this is Robo Aaron's best chance to immediately strike back, which HWK obviously does not want. So... Okay. 
Right now, HWK is back on the offense, but I think only one of their robots has touched the ball, so right now they could not shoot a valid goal. Um, and as the four seems to be alone at the front there, that might be quite difficult. But the other robot's coming back, so maybe he's getting some reinforcements very soon. Um, but he's definitely fighting his way through, so um, I'm not. I, I think this goal should not count, but. Um, Um, if they can get reinforcements coming, um, I'm not sure if HWK is aware that they're not allowed to shoot the goal yet. Um, the four definitely seems to be trying uh, its best to, to get there. Um, and Robo Aaron also does not seem to be able to clear the ball right now. Um, okay, now they got it away. So the, the danger has passed for now. And. Um, it's flipped to the opposite side. Now Robo Aaron is back on the attack. And um, of course, two of HWK's uh, attackers need to make their way back now, which the four does not do yet. So they are um, struggling with their numbers a bit right now. Um, let's see if they're able to successfully defend this attack. Um, or if Robo Aaron gets their um, hopefully second goal for them. There's. Not much time left, only three minutes to play, so um, this might be really tough. Oh, there's it's time to shoot, it's blocked. Oh, successful defense by HWK. They got two robots in the way, and now, of course, they need to get it out of the danger zone first. But Robo Aaron is not stopping, and um, the green seven is um, valiantly trying to make his way through, preparing for another shot, it seems. Oh, and kicking the other robot. Now that's the kind of violence that we don't want to see here. <laughs> but successful dribbling and then pushing, which was correctly punished. So HWK now. Uh, All right, so a bit of confusion uh, because there was no foul called, even though there should have been. But um, let's see if HWK can use the confusion to uh, get back to the enemy side of the field, where two of Robo Aaron's robots are forced to stand on the sidelines right now. So they do have a numbers advantage right now, making their way with through, and indirect kick rule is certainly not active this time. Um, so they do have a chance to actually successfully make that shot. And sadly, they put it a bit too much forward. So Robo Aaron might... Oh! What's getting very interesting again is... Is HWK able to make their way through? It seems that way for now. He still has the ball. Oh, and it's... Almost got stuck again. But HWK still has control of the ball. Another uh, attempt at a shot, which was sadly not successful. But they're making their way through. Now they just have to get through each other. Um, not blocking your own teammate would, of course, be perfect right now. But, oh, they don't quite manage to stand up. But the shot to the goal would be clear. But it's a very messy situation. And, of course, the standing up is not. Oh. No, but the... Oh! Oh, no! And an own goal by Robo Aaron because their robot got, uh, their, their goalkeeper got confused. All right, and that concludes the game. And in a very unlucky turn, it's uh, Robo Aaron shoot an own goal. So HDWK win 2-1. to one.